I'm RJ from Kern Photo in Denver, Colorado. My name is Amanda Tipton and I'm with Kokoro Photography. Here we are in the cruise room of the Oxford Hotel. Uh, we're going to be pretty much shooting with two prime lenses, two photographers with somewhat different styles and approaches, and I hope you enjoy what we put together. So today we're working on a vintage style shoot. And there's some things that you want to think about when you're setting up a vintage shoot in terms of styling and location and things like that. We're shooting today in the Oxford Hotel's cruise room. It's actually a uh, Art Deco space. The style shoot that we're doing though is late 50s, early 60s. If you were going to be in the 50s and 60s, if you wanted a place that had a little gravitas, you wouldn't necessarily pick some place to go that's new. You would be looking for something that's older. So the cruise room is perfect for what we're looking for. Equipment breakdown for today's shoot. I'm using a 24-1-4, so wide angle prime lens. Renders a very shallow depth of field, gives that little 3D pop. Love my 8514 as well, a little bit more compression. Uh, shallow depth of field makes that background go beautiful. We're lighting our uh, vintage shoot with hot lights as opposed to strobes, and there's a couple of reasons for that. One is that the hot lights are more vintage. The light behind me is actually a Fresnel that would have been used in the time period, so it's exactly what we would have used. It, it gives you a very particular kind of quality of light that we're looking for. The other reason is it allows RJ and I to shoot at the same time. We're not worried about who's got what strobes firing at any given time. So we can shoot 90 degrees to each other, and we've each got a different quality of light for the same setup. There's so much that you can go back and look at history to come and find inspiration and lighting is just one of those nuances of photography that can make or break a style.